Hey guys, um, I'm in the car and I'm on the way to get a kitten. Someone I know from high school is giving away their kittens and so I'm going to go check them out. If they're healthy, if they look like they are well taken care of, then I'll bring one home. But we don't have anything for the cat yet, so first we're going to go to PetSmart and then buy the litter box, the food, the bed, and everything like that. So cute. Okay, we just picked out our kitten. Oh my gosh, it's a girl. We didn't know if we wanted a boy or a girl. I'm a little bit allergic to cats and I already got hives on my Turn right. hand. Yep, that's a hive. Mew! <laughs> oh my gosh, it's probably scared. It's a really bumpy road. Hi, you trying to peek your head out of your little cage? so cute okay we just got home we bought the kitten a little bed and a scratcher toy and some food it doesn't eat hard food yet but it will in a few we got some canned food let's see we had to buy you know like everything from scratch because we don't own any pets this is for the food this is for the water it matches. We got the matching set. This is the litter box we got. Now what do we do? <laughs> she just came out of her cage. This is her first time in her new home. She has stripes like a tiger. We should call her Tigress. Tiger Lily. Oh my gosh, after my favorite um kid movie, babe. Should we call her Tiger Lily? She's so small. She's like so She's small. So and our kitchen's all messy, trying to figure out how to get the litter box together. You like your new bed? She really likes her bed, babe. Touch. She's only been in her bed for two seconds. And she's already closing her eyes to go to sleep. <laughs> guys I'm just gonna go over what the first week was like having a kitten and I think that what I learned is that being a pet parent is much like having a child during her day I schedule in feedings naps cuddles playtime potty training I even have to gently wipe her bottom with wipes after she poops and I take her a bath clip her nails brush her hair brush her teeth I have to watch her like a hawk because even though she's really cute, she's always getting into trouble. She's like right here. <laughs> she just woke up from a nap, so I'm trying to like let her settle into herself right now and yawn and stretch and stuff before I show her on camera. You have the hiccups. You were so cute. Everybody, say hello to my little kitty. She doesn't want to be handled right now. So I'm just going to answer a couple commonly asked questions that I've been receiving on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter from you guys. So the number one question that was asked on my social media was what is the kitten's name and what is the kitten's gender? So it is a girl. My kitten's name is Princess Tiger Lily off of the Peter Pan character, the Native American princess, the one that gets abducted by Captain Hook. But we're actually calling her Lily though. We're not calling her Princess Tiger Lily. We're calling her Lily only when we address her. So the second question that was asked was why did I get a kitten in the first place? Because everybody knows I am a dog person and it's because I couldn't have a dog. My landlord would not let me get a dog because our apartment is newly renovated. She didn't want the wear and tear on her new appliances, doors, walls, anything like that. So I couldn't have a dog. And I really wanted an Australian Shepherd. But it's just not in the cards. Now, kittens 
I had no idea that they were just as high maintenance as dogs. The reason why I wanted a kitten in the first place was because I thought that they were aloof. I thought that they were independent. I thought that they played by themselves. I thought that you just lay their food out and they just eat it whenever. No, <laughs> no. I had no idea that kittens were so high maintenance. Kittens are like newborn babies. They always want your attention. I can't even walk outside of my room without her meowing and looking for me. She always wants to be by me 24-7. She usually sleeps like right on my neck or my boob or my shoulder or my head or my side, like tucked under. So this is her hugging my face while falling asleep. She's so sweet and affectionate. I'm really happy that I got her as a furry friend. The last questions that were asked was, what is her breed? She's a brown tabby cat, and her breed comes from a line of leopards. And then what is her age? She is six weeks old. I'll make sure to do an update on her when she gets older. But that's all for now. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye!